If you're looking to buy cheap and custom controllers, be sure to check out singegaming.com and use discount code CSHD for 5% off. What's going on guys, Casual Savage here, in this video we'll be telling you about Swing Copters, Flappy Bird gets a release date. Becoming hugely popular on the App Store and Play Store almost overnight, Flappy Bird scraped in huge sums of money for its creator Dong Nguyen on an apparently daily basis. Unfortunately that wasn't enough to keep him happy though, and his newfound fame, or should that be infamy, caused him to pull the game and almost disappear. Now though, after promising to make a return with a new game, Nguyen is set to just do that. Titled Swing Copters, the new game takes what was so addicted about Flappy Bird and builds on it by adding new obstacles as well as moving, swinging hammers that gamers must avoid while trying to rack up as high a score as possible. Still difficult according to people who have played it, Swing Copters declines the side scrolling gameplay of Flappy Bird in favour of vertical scrolling that for some reason reminds me of a tad doodle jump. I'm pleased that New End's new game isn't simply a new Flappy Bird game, but also that the new offering manages to retain some of the charm and headbanging frustration gameplay of the title that it succeeds. I know I can't wait to give it a try, and I expect to see it surge to the top of the App Store charts shortly after its highly anticipated release. Swing Copters into the App Store on August 21st and will be free to download. Nguyen clearly wants to try and recreate the cash cow that Flappy Bird was created because there will be a $1 in-app purchase for those that want to get rid of all the ads. Pretty sneaky if you ask me. And what you've been watching on the screen is the preview of the game. If you found anything annoying, well, sorry to break it to you, but that's just what the video is. Imagine what it, the real thing will be like when you play it. And yeah, be sure to follow me on Twitter and like my Facebook page because I do post daily on there. I post gaming news and technology news, not just one time a day, but several times a day. Also, be sure to check out my gaming channel where I do post daily on that as well. And be sure to follow me on Snapchat where I just post what I do throughout my day. So yeah, it's been Casual Savage here. I hope you've liked this video. Please subscribe, rate, and peace.